Here comes our final presentation. Uh, Dr. Daphne Segret is an assistant professor in the theater arts program here at LMU, where she teaches directing and theater for social justice. Previously, she's taught intro to theater, solar performance, Latin American and U.S. Latinx theater courses, and multiple theater pedagogy classes. Focusing on Afro-Latinx performance, she completed her PhD at NYU in educational theater in 2017. Before that, she received her MA in educational theater from NYU, an MA in social studies from Columbia University, and holds a BA from Lehigh University. When she isn't teaching, she is directing professional productions or holding workshops across the country on theater for social change. Oh my goodness. Okay. No pressure. <laughs> we do. We hold ourselves back. In theater, actors, directors, designers, we're the ones that are at fault for holding ourselves back. Our fears, our lack of self-love, our constant need to suppress vulnerability, and letting people, I mean, letting us be seen, you would think. But vulnerability, for example, is the least celebrated emotion in society. So I have some suggestions for you. Study yourself, become your own mentor, your best friend. Um, and when you're suffering, stay at the bottom until you find who you are. Let the storms come and pass. How you walk through the fires is a lot about you. How you manage the chaos matters. One of the best guides is how to self-love and to give yourselves the love that you often dream about and that you're not receiving from others or that you give to others but not enough. <laughs> Be selfish um, with yourself. Transcend those fears and follow through the void instead of letting yourself get eaten up. Freedom is being yourself without permission. Be soft and leave a lasting impression on everybody you meet. Even if our society shuns you because they like to shun people who have a brighter light in the world. It doesn't matter because at the end of the day, the only person who will ever leave us, no, the only person who will never leave us, the only person who is always with us is ourselves.